Hey guys, it's Pose. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new match day vlog. And yesterday, Stoke were going up against Southampton at the Beverly 6 5. And today's going to be it's a big game. It's probably the biggest test of our season so far. Recently relegated side, Southampton, currently sitting 10th in the Championship. And they've been on quite some ropey form. Um, just recently, they've only just won their first game in five against Leeds. And Stoke have only just won their first game in about five games. They're also against Bristol City, also coming from 2 0 down. If you guys haven't seen that vlog, check it out. It is, I think it's a banger coming up from 2 0 down some scenes at the end. So, yeah, like I say, Southampton have not been on great form. Most of their good results came at the start of the season, but like I say, the last five games, they got a 5 0 defeat to Sunderland, a 4 1 to Leicester, and yeah, it's only just beating Leeds on the last match today. So, it's going to be a close game, and you think Stoke are actually more informed. Stoke actually got four points out of the last 15. Obviously, Southampton have got three. So, Stoke are the more informed side, but you can't doubt Southampton's quality. They've probably got a, they've got a much better squad than us. So yeah, without, I don't think they're gonna not win. Um, my prediction is probably going to be I'm realistic, so I'm probably going to say like two 0 Southampton. But I'm I'm hoping for something. I'd be happy with at least a point. You no know, recent Premier League team. I'd be happy if we can get something from them. But it's going to be a cold Tuesday night. It's a, it's our home bread and butter, isn't it? So yeah, you never know. But we'll look forward to it. But don't forget, guys, if you guys go on to enjoy the vlog, make sure you leave a like. And if you're new, hit subscribe as well. It's free. You can cancel at any time. So, yeah, without further ado, it's quite sunny right now, but it won't be become 8 o'clock when the kickoff's on. So, yeah, another game on Sky as well, but it's better in person. So, yeah, let's go down. Go on, Stoke. <laughs> Well, then we are around 15 minutes away from kickoff here at the Bet365 Stadium. It's the 30, Jack Bonner. Number 34, Randy Fielding. Number 6, Wouter Berger. Your number 11, Dwight Kay. Number 15, Jordan Thompson. Number 18, Number 21, Nikola Jovic. Number 22, Ben John Ho. And your number 30, Sol Sidney. Now for Stoke City starting 11. In goal for the Potters tonight, your number 1, Mark Travers. Number 4, Ben Pearson. Number 12, Daniel Johnson. Number 16, Ben Wilmot. Number 17, Kiana Hoover. Number 20, Sian Akshavanovic. Number 23, Luke McNally. Number 24, Junior Chiamadu. Number 27, Lady Larisse. Number 28, your captain, Josh Laurent. And please put your hands together and first start to the red and white of Stoke City. Number 35, Nathan Lowe. Thank you for the call under the lights here at the Big Blue Six Star Stadium. Please welcome your two teams, South Africa and New York.
goal. Well done. Hey. side again.
have lost it. You're booking him. He won the fucking ball rap. Correct. Then the guys half time, Stoke 1 0 down, and uh, it's a good goal to first free kick, obviously. But the nature of how they got that free kick is obviously what's angering a lot of Stoke fans. They uh, give an advantage, whilst, and then they carry on playing the attack, and then obviously he's pulled it back, which led to the free kick. And then after that, the referees lost the game. Pearson won the ball, then given a yellow card, and it's just a slow but sh crappy advantages that the refs given and booking players for. So it's just, the referee's lost the game now at this point, and even one minute added time at the end of the first half isn't justified. How how long it took to settle that free kick, etc. It's not one minute. So uh, we've been all over him though first half. Uh, first half now we've done really well. It's just that poor referee decision which just cost us. So I wouldn't make any changes. Just attack with a little bit more heart and put more precision on the passings. That's what's let us down. And then yeah, we're in here, and then we can actually probably nick something from these. So. Just keep going, Stoke. Come on. Ball. Go on, Dave. Oh. Got a chap. Well done. Ball Chamadou.
Guys coming out now, Southampton 1 1 0. It was a good goal, I give them that, like I said at half time, but they didn't deserve to win that game by, by far. Referee, absolutely shambolic. Every single touch we give on the Southampton players, a contact sport, and every single touch we give them, it's a free kick. And every single time they touch those or got bundled over it, nothing. It's just a shambolic, absolutely shambolic. So I don't know what's going to happen now. I reckon Stoke could actually fucking <laughs> go to the fucking FA about that refereeing performance. That was woeful. 
So, but we have to move on. That was a very strong performance against, obviously, against the recently relegated side. And if we go like that against Leicester, we might actually stand a slight bit of a chance, but you never know. So, yeah, like I said, um, free kick was good. Like, obviously, I've had to do their bit and just hold on to it, but we could have got something from that. We had so many good chances, and it's had a bay chance right at the end where you just try to do like a roulette type of back heel shot. It's just like, just, just hit it. Hit it so on on your left foot and it goes in. But anyway, it doesn't matter. If you guys enjoyed this vlog, nevertheless, if you have, make sure you leave a like. And if you're new, hit subscribe as well for more so -city content. Like I say, I'm going to the Leicester game on Saturday, so be sure, be sure to tune in for that. So yeah, it's poems I'm signing out. Peace and refs. Sort your refs out, FA.